Hi friends, I'm back from my little Easter visit at home <laughs> and actually before Easter I got two very nice uh, and lovely packages and we will start with this one, I've unpacked it <laughs> just before Easter um, and the first one was from Alex um, and we did a little treat and he did send me this absolutely beautiful American lock, I love these uh, you can see it's a little newer one. It has a long chain and I've attached the keys to it. Um, and I will pick this uh, in the second part uh, with a surprise. I show you in a second. And I had the older model already. You can see it on the on the font. This the old font with the little newer font. Uh, this doesn't have a key and I've picked it uh, before. You can see the difference, and uh, the newer one actually has uh, some pretty nice spools, uh, some serrated, and uh, as far as I've learned, uh, also a normal pen. Uh, very, very cool locks, I really love them, uh, <laughs> and I hope I got more one day. <laughs> um, and you also have the original package, you can see it, it was in this very nice package and you also did send me a little uh, globe padlock here <laughs> from Shanghai, China <laughs> uh, it's so small I haven't got it picked so far <laughs> I had it with me um, on the vacation trip but very very nice thanks a lot Alex uh, I'm really happy about this um, and the other package I got was from a friend uh, Julian and I will unpack it bit by bit <laughs> the first thing he did send me a couple of more of these uh, very nice uh, sanding sponges um, and I used them um, to make my wooden handles for these uh, sparrow picks um, from the wood I got from Tobias and Julian very very cool I have more than enough now <laughs> Will lay it to his side, and he also included me. Um, I have not unpacked it, and I don't want to unpack it really uh, at the moment. Uh, it's uh, a color uh, for wood, and uh, you will see which color it is in a second. <laughs> I will set it uh, back in the box for now. <laughs> uh, I don't want it over my table. <laughs> A very very nice color and also he included me two locks to play with <laughs> uh, one is a uh, Wilka Euro you can see it Three, four, five, six, a nice six pin lock uh, not too hard I've picked uh, during my vacation this side <laughs> uh, and there's another lock uh, I have actually no idea what brand it is Probably also a stock lock. You can see the key, and this is so so nasty teeth. Don't know if you can see it when I hold it here in the light. Um, it really is really very nasty, and you can see it also on the goose of a key. Uh, I haven't got a pick inside so far, <laughs> but I only had um, my pocket pick with me. So, thanks for these locks, Julian. Um, and there is another thing here inside. Uh, some more pieces of wood. <laughs> and he did send me a pick blank, <laughs> already glued uh, into some wood. <laughs> in 0.5 uh, millimeter. Very cool. Uh, I will have a play with this. Um, Normally I file my pick blanks before I glue them to the wood, so this is a little harder challenge. And there were also some sweets inside. <laughs> uh, I did already eat one of these uh, with strawberry uh, flavor. <laughs> um, yeah, here's the color. And as the biggest surprise, uh, I, I have to say I did know before. Uh, um, but I did only know of one. <laughs> it's nicely packed in this uh, cloth here, so that it is well protected. Uh, and I will 
unroll the, the first part here. You might have seen a bit of it. <laughs> it's an absolutely amazing pick. Uh, and it's colored with this blue color here. Um, it's a little, yeah, I would say um, a, a hybrid profile. Very, very cool. And uh, actually, he did, uh, <laughs> did let me choose before, and I uh, did choose this hook. And I didn't know that he would include <laughs> the hybrid also. So I have no two custom made picks made by Tobias. Uh, absolutely amazing. They're polished uh, like hell and yeah and I will use this uh, later or maybe this I'm not sure at the moment uh, to pick the, the very nice American lock from Alex. So see you in the next part and uh, you two have a very very big thanks. Uh, it was a really nice Easter surprise for me. <laughs> um, so see you in the next part. Hi friends, welcome back to the second part of the video. I've cleaned up the table and clamped the nice American lock from Alex in the vise. Um, it's working beautiful. Uh, it's cutaining uh, as it has a US stamped in the back. Let's see. And um, so it's probably from a government job, uh, which are often key retaining. I will go top of the kiwi and use the short hook here from Julian. So let's see how it goes. Okay, nice clicks. I'm very careful here. These. Okay, some more clicks. Okay, okay, got a little false set. Ah, touched pin three and got a deeper false set. So hopefully this will work out. You can see a little bit of counter rotation. I have picked this lock before. And I think I got it set, but something dropped. Ah, and here it's open. <laughs> Pin 1 did fall down. <laughs> um, it's a pretty tough pick, um, I have to say. Uh, sometimes it opens really easy, sometimes not. Uh, um, one interesting thing is, I don't know if you can see it, uh, here's the locking actuator, here's uh, actually the core, uh, you can't take it out, it's uh, riveted into the lock body and uh, the locking mechanism is coming from the side, so locking the shackle here. Pretty nice design, uh, I would love if you could uh, get it, uh, but doesn't matter, it's a very nice lock. Uh, I can confirm <laughs> a lot of salvations and uh, at least one spool. Uh, pretty cool lock. Have a big thanks, uh, Alex. Uh, and have a big, big thanks, um, Julian, <laughs> for these very cool picks. You can see at my hand, uh, the color goes a little bit off. <laughs> yeah, pretty, pretty nice. Uh, and I've used actually Julian's uh, top of the keyway tensioner get it picked. And there's another thing I would <coughs> like to uh, direct your attention to and this uh, are two um, YouTube channels from friends and the first one is from the lock picking patrolman. Uh, please do me a favor and visit him, he is really doing a nice job. Um, and the other one, uh, sorry it takes a second, uh, is from another good friend um, and he's called Darkwood Picks and he does amazing picks um, as you can see here in the photos um, please give him a visit and uh, maybe you like uh, 
has very nice custom picks. Um, <laughs> uh, something I wanted uh, to show you a long time. So, um, thank you very much for watching. Uh, big thanks, my friends, for this nice stuff. And uh, visit my friends on their channels. And see you in the next video. Bye.